How's it going everybody? Here's this little toy I picked up. Uh, I seen it and it needed to have some uh, switches put in it. So we got her for a good price. It looked like everything was alright. Just had the switches that were bad. They were sheared off and broke. In one of my videos, somebody said that I couldn't solder. And there's my solder right there. And that's all my soldering. Um, this item will probably go up on eBay. <clears throat> Well, they sure used a lot of chokes on that. But. Um, you know, I got a little bit into it. But it's not. It's about $100, $125 amp. I'm going to list it for $125. Uh, free shipping. But these are these switches. They're nice little switches. They came from Taiwan. Um, it does work. Preamp works. It's not uh, hooked up to anything right at the moment. Um, I also got a dummy load. That'll be here too. It... Uh, I have a 2 watt dummy load, it's just two uh, 50 ohm resistors twisted together, but it works good for barefoot radios, um, MRF 450s, um, it should do, well it should do 75 RMS, because it's only a 75 watt kicker, but um, it should swing nice. It should swing, I don't know, over 100 probably. Uh, we will find out. Um, but yeah, it's not bad. Not a bad looking amp. It's a Palomar. These are just rubber caps. They go on there. I figured I'd put those on there. They come on there with the switch anyway, so I figured, you know... Might as well throw those in. And that's one funky looking diode. If that's what it is. A couple of these caps look a little swollen. I don't know if you guys noticed that or not. Um, what are they? 2547? I might... Uh, might replace them because they do look a little swollen they don't look like they ruptured or nothing I don't see any stuff um, these I guess somebody called them adjustable capacitors I don't know um, but they do probably to match it into your stuff So, should be clean though. I mean, they use quite a few ferrites, so they really choked her down. But anywho, <clears throat> there's my little mark right there. CR. But anyway, stay tuned for the next one. Paul Amar Repair. I'll get back with you.